Welcome back guys to another video and today we're gonna teach you how you can export your Binance US transaction data and transaction history into coin tracking so you can do your crypto taxes really fast. There are two ways you can do it via API or CSV files and we're gonna teach you both ways today. All right, let's hop into coin tracking and navigate to enter coins, exchange imports, and then Binance US. On the Binance US API side, we can see our instructions how you can get the API key. It is very easy, you have to log in into Binance and then go to the export report. So we're gonna do that. Let's hop in into Binance and then we will go to our options in our account settings. Here we go to export reports and then we have two options, history tax reports, which will be the CSV one and then tax API, which is the API. Let's start with the API and then later on we go and cover the CSV. So let's click generate API. Now we have to verify ourselves with the Authenticator app and we're gonna do that really quickly. Once you have confirmed your Authenticator and the email you got, then a new page will open with your generated text API. Here you have your text key, so the API key, and a secret key, which you both have to copy and insert into coin tracking. Once done and you inserted the API key and the API secret into coin tracking, then you can do some settings for the API key. I like to add the transaction hash for deposits and withdrawals, which gives me some more information about the deposits and withdrawals later on for investigation about transactions, if something is missing. And then just save this Binance US job. Once done, coin tracking will give you the confirmation that the job has been saved. And if you scroll down, then you can see the information about the current API job and you see import zero. Once this turns to import one, the data has been successfully imported into your account and you're good to go. The Binance US API import can take from 30 minutes until three hours. We never know it, depending how much data you have in your account. Not to wait, we will continue with the CSV import for the coin tracking account. So let's go back to Binance and then let's go back to our export reports. Then we will see the history tax reports on the left side. Now we click generate reports to generate our CSV report for coin tracking. Important to know with Binance is that Binance only lets you to export one year of transaction data. So if you have been trading for many years on Binance, then you have to export 21, 22, 24, and so on and so on. For our case, we have to choose all assets then the transaction types, we have all transaction types, then the date range, so the custom date range of 12 months, you have to select it, let's say November 5th, and then go back until November 5th, 22, and then confirm. And then for the file format, you have to choose CSV, that's the accepted form in coin tracking, and then you click generate. This also can take a few minutes, up to three hours Binance says, and I prepared that in advance, so we have all history here and we can download it. Once the download is finished, we can go back to coin tracking and import the CSV file. We click CSV import here on the left side, or if you are not on this page anymore, go to enter coins, go to exchange import CSV, and then go to Binance US. Now we are here on the right side, we can see what the CSV can import. It can import all the trades and all the files, withdrawals, deposits, and fees. So we're good to go here. On the left side, we again have instruction how to get the CSV file in case you missed something or you want to read it up here in the instruction. And then we click choose file. Choose the CSV from Binance. Continue to import. And then you can import all your trades. In our case, we don't have anything in the Binance US account, so you don't see anything here. But if there will be some trades, you just start to import and coin tracking will confirm that the import has been done. Then in the enter coins page, you would see all the trades you imported just from Binance US and same in the balance by exchange by the reporting, you would see a balance for Binance US. Once we have consolidated all the correct data and coin tracking and we fixed the missing transactions, validated the transactions and everything is spot on, then we can proceed with our tax report. To generate our tax report, we simply go to tax report and click tax report. Now we are in the crypto tax report site where we can generate our tax report. But before we have to set up the tax report with some options and settings. So for the country, we select our country, in our case it's Germany, but there's a variety you can choose from. Then for the tax method, we use first in, first out. But again, there are a lot of tax options you can choose from and 
depending on your situation, choose the right taxation method. Then for the tax year, we use 23 as our tax year. But again, depending on your trading behavior, there will be many different years uh, to choose from and depending on your need to generate the tax year you need. Then for the filters, you can include and exclude specific transaction types if you want to. Then previous trades, consider all previous trades in the report. This is an option you should leave on. Then you can use the deposit separation tax slots if you want to or not. And you can group all purchases by day and group all search by day. If you have a lot of transactions in your account, this will speed up the generation process of the tax report. Once all done and you have your settings in, we can generate a new tax report. Once you have generated a new tax report, you will see in the bottom the total capital gains and the year of the taxation, the taxation method. And if you want to see more information about your tax report, simply click load report. This is a much more detailed view of the report. And once it's loaded up, we will see all the details about the report. The details have loaded and now we can see how much capital gains we had, how much income we had. And if you scroll down, you will see even more details line by line, transaction by transaction, what you exactly did, how much you profited off it or lost on it. We see the income, we see the gift donations, the fee report, the lost and stolen, the closing positions. We have everything in this report. And if you need to submit your report, then simply scroll up and go to download to end this report and then simply click download PDF or download Excel and then you can submit it or give it to your CPA and move from there on. We hope this video was helpful to you and if there are any open questions, please leave them down in the comments and we will happily answer all the comments for you. Please give the video a like, subscribe to the channel and check out our playlist with all the other exchanges where we guide you step by step how to export the API or CSV and import them into coin tracking so you can do your crypto taxes easily. We wish you happy trading and we'll see you soon. Bye bye.